In this video, I will show you how you can create your vertical browser animation smart animate in Figma. So I will show you everything in this video, like how this vertical animation will work in Figma and how you can make this yourself in your project. So I will show you everything in this video. So make sure that you watch this video till the end. And if you haven't subscribed to my YouTube channel, please go and subscribe. So let's get started with this tutorial. Welcome back to my YouTube channel, MW Design Strategies and so uh, as i told you i will show you everything in this video like how you can create your vertical you know animation smart animate in figma browser animation in figma so i will show you everything in this video how this browser will work so i will show you everything in this video so make sure that you subscribe to our channel and so let's get started with this story so without wasting any time i'm just gonna uh, copy this outside so what we have to do first of all you know the process will be the same but you know the design will be different and the animation will be different so this animation will be like in this way right so this will be in vertical way okay so uh, in order to do that as i told you in the previous video what you have to do you have to get all the stuff in this particular rectangle so make sure that your all the uh, stuff in the rectangle which is going to be animating right so we have to drag it out like this and now here what we have to do we have to make a component first of all and then create one variant so in design you can see there is a variant section so you can create one variant and then you can click on one more variant you have to create okay and then you can make it a little bit bigger and what uh, you have to do next is to you know make it in center and then this one should be as per the this size okay so as i told you in the previous video this one should be as per this size so make it like this and drag it here like this okay so and this one should also be more smaller like this one which is blow so this one should be as per this right and this one will be more outside right and so you can drag it here and so this should be as equal to this one so make sure as your sizes will be always correct right so the size should be same and then this one should be bigger and this should be as per this one right the, this one right so this size is 486 so we have to make it 486 and so once we made it 486 now we have to make it here you have to put it and adjust it as per this position so the position should always be equal it, it should be a little bit smaller so position should always be equal and then this one should be more bigger same as this one right so this size is 266 so we have to make it 266 which is like this and then this should be equal to this one and all the design all this should be in center right so it should be on center and this should also be a little bit smaller again and this should be a little bit bigger right and so now you don't have to do anything else now we have to now the important thing is what we have to do is to create a prototype so to make the prototype you first of all make sure that your sizes and all the stuff should be equal same as this one like the size is for 486 and this should be 266 so make sure that you all the sizes are correct same as this otherwise you won't be able to see your prototype otherwise you won't be able to you know smart animate this properly right and so this won't be work as this one i have showed you how this works in the uh, in the beginning but you won't be able to do that if, if your sizes are not correct right so make sure that your size should always be correct and as per your design right and this circle should be a little bit outside like this right like this and then what you have to do next you have to create a prototype so you know to make a pro smart prototype you have to go to a smart uh, prototype section and then you can click on the first variant and then you can link it link this to the second one and then the, you can see the settings here so what we have to do the set in settings so we have to make it on click or oh, sorry we have to make it on drag and this should be smart animate and this should be slow and it this uh, millisecond should be 800 milliseconds to uh, thousand milliseconds you can keep or as per your desire as per your whatever you want or whatever the size or you know speed you want for your design for your projects right and this should also be on drag and this should be on slow and again the millisecond should be on uh, should be 800 milliseconds right and so now what we have to do we have to click the first variant and copy your first variant and now we have to click this one and paste it in your design so first where you can paste it in your actual design so once you paste it in your actual design so now what we have to do we have to paste it here and then you can click on this and now you can see this will, this will work like this 
so you can play your prototyping and now you can see this prototyping will work like this this smart animation will work like this so uh, i hope you really enjoy this video and you know really i did like this video if you really like this video then please hit the thumbs up also if you haven't subscribed to my youtube channel and new user then please go and subscribe and so if you want to see more videos like this animation video i create every each and every week so make sure that you subscribe to the channel so to get more videos like this and comment me below if you really want more animation videos more smart animation videos crowser animation other animation cards animation videos comment me below and i will create definitely create a video for you so thank you thank you so much for watching this video and see you later.